If you are earning income, it is absolutely essential that you begin to invest. Now, obviously, there are plenty of different ways that you can start investing, but if you don't know how to start, let's start with something simple. Opening up a Roth IRA. Now, this is by far the best way to grow your investment portfolio to over a million dollars after tax by retirement. But what is it? Why would you open up one? And what does it all mean in the end? Well, in this video, if you stick around for just a few more minutes, we are going to cover all of it. So let's get right into it, guys. So what is a Roth IRA? Well, simply, it's an individual retirement account that you can invest in. And then when you're 59 and a half years old, you can take out all of that money that you've accumulated completely tax free. But why do you want one? Well, you could be 13, you could be 23, you could be 33. It doesn't honestly matter because it's going to be a hundred times better for you to get into the habit of investing now rather than later. And here's why. When you invest your money over time, this money compounds, which means that every single year you make more and more compared to the years before that. An example would be that when we look at this chart here, we see that if you start investing at 25 instead of 35, and this is only $100 a month by the way, you'll have a whopping $80,000 more, which is twice the amount by the time you're 65. Now, it doesn't matter if you're only making say $100 a week, immediately put 10% away. Now, this doesn't seem like much, and to be honest, it isn't, but this is going to get you into the habit of investing so that then when you are making $1,000, $2,000, $3,000 a week, you're still putting 10% away or even more because this is just a natural habit for you at this point. But at this point, you're now probably wondering where and how do I create one? Well, if you're over 18 years old, you probably have all the freedom in the world to go and open one up for yourself. And I highly recommend doing that. But if you're under 18, then you may need to go to a parent or guardian and ask them to open a custodial account for you. Now, when asking them, explain to them why you wanna open one, what the benefits are and everything else. And they then can create a custodial account for you so that you can begin to invest. I personally recommend using Fidelity and Vanguard as brokerages to use, but do your own research because everybody is different. And as I mentioned before briefly, when you withdraw money from this Roth IRA when you are retired, this money doesn't get taxed as it would as if it was in a regular IRA. There is a saying after all that there are only two certainties in life, death and taxes. So if you're putting money towards retirement, it's better for it to be tax-free in a Roth than to have to worry about all of that money getting taxed later on. Now, the opportunities once you open up a Roth IRA are very, very vast. You can now invest in things like index funds, ETFs, individual stocks, and even more. I know when I first opened up my Roth IRA, it was a little overwhelming because it was like, whoa, I can invest in this, I can invest in that, what do I do? This is confusing. But the thing that I really recommend people start with is just ETFs. They're probably the easiest out of everything, and ETFs are basically just funds that are built up of you know, a bunch of different companies. It could be five, it could be 500. It's different for every ETF. But let's just take a quick look at this ETF right here. For those of you who don't know, this ETF here is one of the most popular. It's called the S&P 500 ETF. But say I invested $100 into this. Automatically, $7 of that $100 would go into Apple. $5.66 would go into Microsoft. And about $3 would go into Amazon and so on and so forth as the amounts for each company get smaller and smaller until that $100 is completely filled with all these different companies. Now, the thing with ETFs is they're a much lower risk investment than say traditional stocks, for example, and this makes them really great to start with. And obviously with the world the way it is right now and high inflation in many countries, we're seeing higher prices for goods, services, and pretty much everything for that matter. So if you wanna remove individual stock risk, ETFs are definitely a really great choice. Now, the last thing I have to mention in this video is that if you have a number of years until retirement, then time is truly on your side and starting now is going to be a lot easier than starting later. So the sooner you start, the better the rewards will be later on in your life. The best way to start doing this is just to contribute regularly. This strategy is definitely most effective when investing in your Roth IRA and other things. And like I said earlier, it doesn't have to be much because it really will add up over time. So at this point, obviously you have some knowledge about a Roth IRA and investing, but to truly start investing, you are missing one key step, having a free cash flow. 
And with this video right here, where I talk about the absolute best ways to make passive income this year, you will be right on your way to becoming financially abundant and living the good life. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.